Hello people from the future, welcome to Ramalize Nerd. In this video, we are gonna learn about recurrent neural networks. If you are new to my channel, then please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon. I make videos about machine learning and data science regularly. In the last video, I have shown you how you can implement what to vec model and Glove model along with LSTM, which is a kind of recurrent neural network. But I never really explained what an RNN is. So what is artificial intelligence is gonna explain RNN to you. They have a beautiful YouTube channel where they explain different terms in machine learning and artificial intelligence. Please check their channel and don't forget to subscribe. Okay, let's get started. Over to What's AI. Recurrent neural networks, also known as RNNs, are a class of artificial neural networks specialized in approaches that are effective at processing sequential information. The main strength of an RNN is the capacity to memorize the results of previous computations and use that information in the current computation. This makes RNN models suitable to model context dependencies in inputs of arbitrary length so as to create a proper composition of the input, which is the perfect fit for natural language processing applications. As we are feeding a sequence of words into the RNN, the state gets updated for each word being input. As a result, the state essentially becomes a representation of all the words which have been processed so far. And since the state gets updated in a sequential manner, the state will also contain information about the order of the words as well as the words themselves. Let's take an example sentence of, deep learning is hard but fun, and consider the states at each step as the RNN is processing this sentence. When deep is fed into the RNN, the state contains the representation of just the word deep. Next, when we feed learning into the RNN, it will update the state which had a representation of just deep to now contain a representation of deep plus learning. As the RNN continues to get the words from the sequence, the final state contains the representation of deep learning is hard but fun. The final state of the RNN contains both semantic information of the words in the sentence as well as sequential information regarding the order of the words. Which is perfect to understand a sentence since it works just like our brain. The uses of recurrent neural networks go far beyond text generation to machine translation, image captioning, and authorship identification. Although these applications will not displace any humans, it's conceivable that with more training data and a larger model, a neural network would be able to synthesize new, reasonable patent abstracts. Thank you What's AI for this awesome explanation. I hope by now you have an overview about recurrent neural networks and obviously in future I'm gonna make more videos about this topic. If you have liked this video, please subscribe to both of our channels. And as always, thanks for watching.